Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Taylor Lauren here. Here on my channel, I talk about my life as a beauty queen, as a wife, and as a mama. So if that content interests you, then just keep on watching. Today, we are going to be doing an updated 11 to 12 month baby feeding update and some baby led weaning things. So if that interests y'all, then just keep on watching. So my baby girl, Blair, is 11 months now. So I wanted to give you guys an update on how we're feeding her. And we have also started the weaning process from breastfeeding. So I wanted to give you guys some info on that too. So now that she is 11 months, I believe like at nine or 10 months, we started giving her pouches. So we started giving her these little pouches um, this is the Simple Organic or Simple Truth Organic brand. We also give her Plum and a Happy Baby. Um, and this has been really convenient as of late because now that I'm working part time as a nanny, I'm always on the go with our nanny child who is older than Blair. So she's become more, watching him, she's become more interested in like self feeding and all those types of things. And she can hold these pouches, they're resealable. So she doesn't finish it, we can save it for later. Um, I've also um, have refilled them, but that can be a little tedious. So um, I do, I have seen some refillable silicone pouches by Hakka that I wanna get soon. Um, but as of late, this is what she has been eating. Um, she also does some uh, some self feeding. Um, she loves sweet potato fries. Um, if I'm eating something, I usually share with her. She loves um, so she absolutely loves these little baby teething crackers. Um, this is like her favorite snack. Um, this brand is by Happy Baby Organics. Happy baby um sweet potato and banana and blueberry and purple carrot they have other flavors and other colors too um we get her these long ones and the little circle ones i think these are better for her to hold um but she loves them she eats them up she probably has maybe four packs of these a day and i try to keep like two in my bag at all times so these are like her snacks that she loves and then her pouch would be like breakfast lunch dinner whatever um, and then she loves sweet potato fries. I always have sweet potatoes on hand to make those for her and just cut them up in wedges. We throw them in the air fryer. Um, whatever we're eating, she'll pick from as well. So we have those. Um, she still is also on Beach Nut Naturals. So from the time we got the go ahead from our pediatrician to start solids at three months up until about nine, 10 months, she would breastfeed and do these and then do like her sweet potato fries or like pick over anything we were eating. Now, she doesn't really like to be fed. Um, she just wants the pouch. So what I've been doing is putting her jar food in piping bags and refilling them. It is very tedious, but I have found some refillable Hakka pouches on Amazon that I'm planning on getting. Um, we still do the beech nut jar food because we are on WIC and we get these for free on WIC, on Georgia WIC. So that's that. She doesn't really like to be fed. So we still get these and transfer them over to a pouch so that she can feed herself. So that has been kind of like our feeding journey thus far. That's an update for that. Now for weaning and breastfeeding. So we have been weaning for about three days now. We're giving ourselves from 11 months up until her first birthday to do it. So I've done this in the past with other families um, as a nanny and it's proven successful. So I'm hoping that it will work for us as well. Um, I wanted to give us a month to wean Blair just for her sake and for my sake. Um, it is very emotional. I would like to, I wouldn't mind breastfeeding her for maybe like 14 months. I don't think I would wanna go longer than that. Um, just because I don't really have a desire to. I told myself from the beginning that I wanna breastfeed for a year. Now that we're approaching that, um, I don't want to really like go back on my word and she doesn't really need it. Um, and then Blair um, doesn't really care to nurse more than twice a day. She has a big feed in the morning and then when she's cranky during the day, I'll just pop the boob in her mouth to soothe her. But she's not really like feeding. It's more of a bonding and soothing and just to calm her down. So really she only breastfeeds 
like a big good feed like once a day first thing in the morning so I said you know it's time um, I think she's ready and I think my body is ready now if your kid isn't ready and if your body isn't ready then you will have to readjust to how you see fit for your family but for us I think a year is good um, also because that's what I've been saying since I've been pregnant and just putting that out there and speaking that into existence I think just my mind and my body and my emotions and Blair um, are ready to stop in a year so what we've been doing to get her off of the boob I will still pop the boob in her mouth first thing in the morning maybe for no more than two minutes and then I will give her her um, sippy cup with almond milk in it let me go get her cup. Okay, so like I said, um, first thing in the morning, I'll give her just a little bit of boob for no more than two minutes, and then I will switch her over to her sippy cup, um, and she will drink about eight ounces of almond milk. I was really surprised about how much she was drinking because, you know, when you're breastfeeding, you never really know <laughs> how much they're getting. Um, and we got um, this Nook bottle recently it came in a pack of two off of amazon i really like nook um it's a german brand of bottles these are the bottles that we use with the nipple um and then we recently upgraded to this one that has the um sippy cup on it blair takes it really well um at first she was just using it to like teeth um but now she has grown to like it and she will drink out of here um so that's what we've been doing um i will give her I've started giving her milk right when she wakes up, when she goes down for a nap, and right before bed, um, just so that she can get used to the taste of the milk and just like holding her sippy cup and getting used to that, you know, transition off the boob. Um, at, at nap time and before bed, she will take the bottle. She, she doesn't need to have my boob first, but first thing in the morning um, is a big adjustment because that's been like her biggest breastfeeding moment as of late so first thing in the morning I will give her the boob first and then you know take her off and give her the bottle just so it's a smoother adjustment for her um and I've noticed that she is sleeping like more and sleeping better because of that because really now only like my left boob is like my really good boob my right doesn't really produce much anymore so um I'm glad that <laughs> she's getting full and that she's actually sleeping better because she's getting like enough milk from, you know, almond milk versus me, like I'm running drier and drier by the week, you know? <laughs> so that's that. Um, the almond milk that we give her is the original Simply Almond um, by Simply Made, all natural. Um, Blair has essentially been a vegan baby. Like she, we don't give her meat here at home. When she's at Gigi's house, that's a different story. But she hasn't really had a lot of meat um, just because we just didn't see a need for it. I was vegan for two years, um, like before my husband and I got married. And then just because I didn't want to do like vegan and non-vegan kitchen, I was just like, I'll just go back. So now, um, I eat well when we first got married I was eating chicken and fish but when I got pregnant y'all I was craving burgers out the wazoo like <sighs> Blair had me eating burgers and now I'm like oh, I want a burger um so I'll probably drop beef again slowly but surely um but yeah she's essentially been a vegan baby we don't do cow's milk at all in this house this just we this is just not us um so when we were deciding on like milk supplements, almond milk was for sure um, our go-to. So this is what we give her. We give her the original. Um, it is sweetened a little bit. And I would say for any of the mamas, if you're trying to find a milk supplement to your breast milk, um, like once your baby is old enough to be off of formula, um, I would say try almond milk because it is sweet like breast milk um, and I think that's why it wasn't a big deal for her I also warm up her milk for her which you know just soothing like if she's just drinking milk during the day she would drink at room temperature but definitely before when she first wakes up but and but when she goes down for a nap when she goes down for bed like those three times where we're weaning um, I definitely warm up her milk for about a minute and 30 seconds because it is she will take like seven ounces um so it's warm and soothing for her um and y'all we are in 
about day three. By the time this video comes out, by the time you're watching it, we'll probably be like a month in. Uh, we'll probably be done waiting, but so far for these three days, I've been trying to be consistent with giving her milk um, in the morning, uh, before nap and before bed. And this is day three of us doing it. And it's been really, really good. She still needs to like have a little boob when she wakes up, but those other two, she's good. Um, and I haven't, I've only breastfed her once for the past three days for like literally those first two minutes in the morning. And it's been good. Um, I haven't felt like engorged or anything. I haven't had to pump. So that just tells me that, yeah, like my body is like slowing down with producing milk. Um, and I just, for us, it's just time. It is just time. I'm ready to kind of like have my body back and also Blair um, she's developing more of a tolerance in the morning because she does wake up like about 6 7 a.m. like screaming her head off for milk but these past couple days she's been a little more patient um, because she knows that she's gonna get a bottle and like she can take her time and all of that or a sippy cup rather than a bottle um, so yeah, I, it's just time for us. I know some people breastfeed for, you know, years and years and years, but our goal was a year. I'm glad we've been able to meet that goal and it's just time. I just think, you know, both, I think just both of us are ready. So that's that. But yeah, if you're trying to wean mama, try some almond milk cause it's sweet like breast milk. And in my experience, it's been working well. And Blair really likes it warm, so you can try to warm it up for your baby. This brand, we usually get at Kroger, our local Kroger, but I'm sure you can find it anywhere. Um, and yeah, it's been working great for us so far. So thank you all for watching. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. Engage with me in the comments down below. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.